Richard from South Shields is next. Hi, Richard. Hello. Hello there. Um, I, I, I'm late again. Okay. What do you want to talk uh, about, Richard? Uh, St. Patrick's Day. Yes. Do you know, I, I would have bought St. Patrick's Day, because the last time we talked about St. David's Day, right? Mm-hmm. Um, like, St. Patrick's Day is the same sort of thing, right? If you catch me drift, like. Mm-hmm. Why, right, because, you know, like, happiness. It's not like happy for, so I've got about St. Patrick's Day. Why? Because, uh, about Ireland and that. You know, like, with, the uh, Iraq and all that, right? Mm-hmm. Um, like, you know, like, when you've got, like, visual things, like, people getting blown apart and all that. Mm-hmm. Um, in Iraq, and I don't think it's fair, you know? Um, What's that going to do with St. Patrick's Day? Well, um, do you know, like, if, if you've got, like, I, the IRE? Mm-hmm. Like, like it, it, in Ireland, right? It's only a little way away from here, right? And there's been a war going on, like, for 20-odd years there, right? Mm-hmm. Or longer, right? No, then, not, not in Ireland. No, but if you put in it in Northern context, Ireland. Right? Uh-huh. Not in Ireland, though. That's a separate country. Ireland. Yeah, there hasn't been a war going on in Ireland. Northern Ireland. The conflict has been in Northern Ireland, which Why? is part of Great Britain. Right, exactly. Right. So it, like, it's our country. Uh, and it's not fair, is it? In, in, in terms of, like, um, like people. Like, do you know, like, St. David's Day? Mm-hmm. Right, St. David's Day was the Star of David, which... Um, no, it, no, 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 it wasn't. No, it wasn't. What? It wasn't. Well, do you know that star that they had to follow? The, the, the three this things. has got nothing to do with St. David. No, well, St. Patrick's Day, right, uh-huh. is exactly the same sort of thing, right? No, it's not. It's got nothing to do with following stars, not a thing. No, well, St. Patrick, well, mm-hmm. obviously, uh, because it's like, well, I'm a day late anyway. Hang on, okay. Now, right. uh, what I always try and ask you is, whenever you talk about anything, I just say, well, why talk really... about something that you don't know anything at all about? Who was St. Patrick? Tell me who St. Patrick was, and then we'll continue the conversation. Well, well, you, if not, you go on the journey again. Now, will you try to tell me what St. David was like before? Yeah, but only because you w- came on talking about something mm. that you didn't have a clue about. And it's the same with now, St. Well, Patrick. St. Patrick. Tell me something about St. Patrick that's true, and we'll keep talking. That's true. Yeah. Right, well, do you know them little goblins? Where's he from? Where's St. Patrick from? From? Yeah, where was he born? What country do you think St. Patrick was born in? St. Patrick. If you can get that right, we'll keep talking. If not, you don't know what you're talking about. Where's he from? Right. Ireland? No, afraid not. Thanks for calling. 0191 Most people accept that he was Welsh, in fact, but he was certainly uh, from one of the British countries. And Ireland, definitely not, because he was actually carried off by pirates to be uh, held as a slave for half a dozen years in Antrim and then he escaped to Britain some believe he escaped to Gaul France because originally a lot of people thought that he was uh, he's French trained as a missionary he then went back into Ireland and he was said to chase all the snakes out and various other things so um, if you didn't know much about St. Patrick just don't ring in and talk about it I mean if you want to talk about what you did for St. Patrick's Day that's fine but uh, Richard always rings in and talks about something as if he knows what he's talking about and doesn't.